Uh, clap your hands if this is your first time at a comedy show ever. All right. You've never been to a comedy club before. Okay, well, that's fun. It's good to know. Um, all right, well, you know, I'm, I'm the headliner. I'm the best comedian here tonight. <laughs> Are you, are you two together? Yeah. How long have you two been together? Ten years. Ten years. Give it up for them. That's a... That's the minimum requirement for clapped claps. Anything less than ten years ain't nothing. How long have you two been together? Eleven years. Okay. That's a long time. Your love is one year stronger than their love. <laughs> You're 22, their love is twice as strong as your love. <laughs> fuck your love. <laughs> and fuck your love too. <laughs> fuck your love too. Anybody been together longer than 22 years? 52. 52 Whoa. years. Is your husband here or no? <laughs> Is he alive? <laughs> Wait, he's not alive? Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> Fuck all your love. <laughs> Fuck all of your love. She got that best love. Damn, 52 years, I'm 35, that's crazy. You were fucking for at least a decade. Before I was even a thought in the universe. Before I was even a thought in... I didn't even exist in a nutsack yet. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that crazy? Do you live together? Do you got any kids? Do you got any plants? Do you got any dogs or cats? Dog. Yeah. What's the dog's name? Murphy. <clears throat> Murphy, classic dog name. <laughs> That's a classic dog name. How big is the dog? <laughs> like, how much does it weigh? 40 pounds. That's a big fucking dog. <laughs> My guy, don't, you don't even look like you weigh 30. <laughs> You look skinny as fuck. Your where's Waldo looking ass? All you missing is the striped tass and the beanie. I'm sorry I'm fucking with you like that. How tall are you, my guy? 5'10. 5'10. What you weigh, like 145? 130. Bro, that means you sick. You are ill. We need to get you some protein powder. I'm in the same boat, I'm 6'1", I weigh 160. Right, I ain't right. Somebody, I fucked up somebody's whole night tonight. You know what I'm saying? But I feel you. How tall are you, my girl? 5'7". How much do you weigh? Is she like 120? 120? 115? I know how to guess people's weight, don't ask me how. Don't ask me how. Okay, so you've been together 10 years. How'd you guys meet? Facebook. Facebook, Facebook, Facebook. Suspicious as fuck. <laughs> oh, oh. Ooh, 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 ah. Facebook, who the fuck meets on Facebook? <laughs> Was it Marketplace? Was it just a DM? <laughs> Bro, Mar Facebook Marketplace. <laughs> Facebook, I, I feel like Facebook Marketplace is a little bit more suspicious than Craigslist. Like, one time I was selling a TV stand on fucking Facebook. This guy came over and he like, what was that meow meow? I heard a meow meow. Is that your phone? Do you guys, did, I'm not crazy, we, I heard a meow meow. Tell me I'm not fucking crazy. Where did that meow meow come from? Who the fuck brought a cat with them? Who the fuck brought an electronic cat with them? Does somebody need to take their insulin? What the fuck is going on? Hey. Right? 
Suspicious as fuck. Yo, but real talk, one time I was doing a, I was doing a, a Facebook marketplace. This guy came over, he was like, the nightstand was basically brand new. And I was selling for 180. He was like, bro, I'll do 160. I said, all right. So then he came over, he's like, bro, I, fuck me, I only brought 140. <laughs> oh, you did? <laughs> oh, you just, you just happened to, I told you how much you brought 140? <laughs> That's crazy, bro. <laughs> so I was like, fuck, are you here? He knew what the fuck was up. <laughs> and then he like, then he like, then he like, came into my apartment and I have a nice place. And like, he like walked in, he came in, and if you buying something off a of Facebook marketplace, you shouldn't be taking more than four steps into an apartment. You know what I'm saying? For like, a, like you know, you, I had it next to the door, like, but he, he walked in like, oh shit, this, oh wow, this is a nice place, huh? Wow, wow. It's like, get the fuck out of here, my guy. This ain't a, a crate and barrel, stop, cut that shit out. <laughs> this ain't a crate and barrel, cut your shit out. <laughs> cut that shit out. So anyway, I help him take the fucking night t TV stand into his van that he lives in. <laughs> Why the fuck you get a TV stand for your van? I don't, the whole guy, the whole thing about the guy was suspicious. <laughs> so, I could tell he was a little off because, you know, he does live in a van. He looked like, um, he, you know who he looked like? He looked like uh, Maui from Moana, you know what I'm talking about? He looked like Maui from Moana. And real talk, he was like, <laughs> he gave me the cash, he accidentally gave me 160. I'm not even making that up, I'm not even making that up. Cause like I said, I think he was a pothead and I think he wasn't thinking. I'm living in a van, I don't know. So then I put it in the van, I didn't tell him, I had the 160, he drove away. Next morning at 7 a.m. I got a text. Bro was like, hey dude, did I give you 160? I'm like, bro, I thought you only brought 140. I don't know, I didn't even count it, I just deposited, I'm sorry my guy. Good luck with everything. I mean, shit, if you're stressing about $20 and you're living in a van, shit must be fucked up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Isn't it interesting how, like, the, the, you know, the social media is trying to make living in a van popular? Have you noticed that? Living in buses and boats and shit? Like, they, they are predicting the future. None of us can afford a house. <laughs> We're all gonna have to live in a school bus like Miss Frizzle. <laughs> We're all gonna be Miss fucking Frizzle up in here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I mean, the vans look cool, but real talk, you're just gonna be living in a Target parking lot. Does not anybody know anybody who lives in a van? You, do you live in it? Do you live in a van? It's okay if you do, I don't know. Damn, bro, van life. Hashtag van life. So what's up, Mike? How long you two been together? 11 years. 11 years. Damn, my guy speak with authority. <laughs> 11 years, and you're 27? Yeah. So you met when you were, what, was that 16? <laughs> and how old were you? How, how old was I, 14? 16 and 14, that's fine. And make, don't worry, it's okay. <laughs> it's not, it's normal, it's not a big deal. Yeah, 16 and 14. That's a long time to be together. Did you, like, when did you guys, did you guys lose your virginity to each other? Oh. <laughs> Honestly, I would hope so. I would hope that that's the case. God forbid, you know what I'm saying? No, we decided we didn't want that awkward night together, so we just picked some randos and then we came back together for that. Are you guys married? Not yet. So, 27, 25, 11 years, now married. But you engaged, put a ring on it, yeah. What you, would you guys do on the first date, like at 16 and 14? Like, are you going to a pizza party? What the fuck's going on? 
Like, are you going at a pizza party? Is it a, like a soccer spaghetti party? <laughs> don't, don't they do that? Don't they do like soccer spaghetti? Like, you know, they get the team, right? <laughs> What's that? We went to Felipe's. You went to Felipe's? Yeah. Felipe's for the win. <laughs> I'm assuming that's Mexican. Is it, is that what it, is it Italian? Oh, what is it? Italian. Did you have a little chicken parmesan? Did you have some, what did you eat on the first date? We want to know, tell us. Pepperoni pizza. Pepperoni pizza. And some spaghetti. And some spaghetti. Is that what you ate? A lot of cheese, a lot of pepperoni. You know the two of them were farting. And you know that they weren't really doing any kissing or hugging. Or were you? Did you do that? On the first day, yeah. Can I ask how old you guys were when you lost your virginity? No. No, I can't ask that. <laughs> Just answer me back. It's not a big deal. It's not a, it's not a, he's like, we still haven't done it yet. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. We still haven't, we still haven't. Suspicious as fuck. <laughs> yeah. Do you two live together? Yes. We do. Did I already ask you that? No. It's hard for me to keep track of the things that I'm saying to you. Do you got a, what size bed do you got? <laughs> Is it a queen bed? A queen bed that's too small. <laughs> you can finance a bigger bed, you can finance. What do you do for work, my guy? Electrician. Electrician. <laughs> Shout out for the vocational jobs. <laughs> and, what, and what about you, girl? Damn, both, there, somebody was doing solar yesterday. We saw that video. Is that your favorite type of energy? <laughs> you don't fuck with wind? <laughs> you don't fuck with water? <laughs> what kind of energy, is that, do you like the solar? <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Hey, have you guys seen me before, ever? No. This is your first time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Popping that cherry. <laughs> but Loki, could you tell me, when did you do it? <laughs> I want to know. Why <laughs> don't you want to know? <laughs> Don't you want to know? Don't you? Don't you want to know? Don't you? Don't you want to know when teenagers have sex? <laughs> Suspicious is fun. You don't have to tell me, that's okay. You don't gotta tell me. But I'm gonna find out. I'm gonna hit you in the DM. <laughs> Suspicious is fun. <laughs> I lost my virginity at 18 in college. It kind of smelled like dookie. I thought that was normal. And then I just realized that college students don't oh, wipe their fucking asshole. <laughs> 
college students, we don't got good hygiene. You don't know nothing about hygiene when you're you in college. Do you guys got wet wipes at home? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. You got a bird day. Yeah. It's the thing that shoots oh, water in your poop shoe. <laughs> it shoots water in your booty hole. Kind of feels good. It's kind of like a little surprise for your butthole. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What's your name, my guy? Zach. Zach and... Jenny. Zach and Jenny. Zach and Jenny, I hope you guys make it. <laughs> I hope you guys make it. And I hope you guys have sex one day. <laughs> What you do for work, my guy, on the right? Work for university. Work for what about you with the fedora? Electrician. Electrician. <laughs> hey, maybe get together, start some cups, see if sparks fly. <laughs> start a company, see, you know, if you can get the wire. Do you have your, is it your own company or what is it? You work, okay. What about how, do you work, like, do you work with somebody else? This is an opportunity, I think. <laughs> I don't know. We got a young guy. We got an old guy. <laughs> He's a white. You're ethnic, and I'm saying like <laughs> he could be the face, because you know how white people are with ethnic people. <laughs> I'm not making it up. I don't make the rules. <laughs> I get stopped at the airport every time. To, I get checked for bomb residue. <laughs> Raise your, raise your hand if you've been checked for bomb residue. <laughs> it's most, all right, it's like, I feel like it's more ethnic people. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Can't be that many of us making bombs, I don't know. <laughs> and if you're making a bomb, why would you come with residue, take a shot? I don't, I just... <laughs> It don't make no sense, it don't make no sense. You know, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> so I'm getting off on a tangent. All right, let's talk to somebody else. What's your, what's your name, girl? <laughs> Bree, how long have you two been in here? Three years. Three years. How'd you guys meet? With me. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's cute. You can tell he's a good looking dude. He's tall. You like that shit? You like a tall guy? <laughs> that guy to just throw you around a little bit. In the, how tall are you? Like 5'9. Okay. How tall is he? 6'4. Six, 6'4. Six, okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you live together? Yeah. What size bed you got? It's fucking king bed, actually. <laughs> You, you guys are big, you need it. Is my boy laying down, he making a sweet love to you? No, he's not. Did she say you don't want to talk about it? It's okay. If you two had an OnlyFans, I'd subscribe. Clearly so with all of them. <laughs> Clearly so with all of them. Here it comes. <laughs> we were talking about you, my guy. <laughs> I was asking her, do he, do he lay it down like that? And I'm like, I bet he does. Do you do? You do? You do be like? I think, I, I think so. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about.
And I'm just thinking about what to tell you, because I feel like I fuck good, too. <laughs> It's what it is, it's just, I feel like I, you know, I can, I'm very verbal. I say the dirtiest, most vile shit in the bedroom. <laughs> the most, I be talking to my girl like, nobody's ever gonna find you. Like, shit like that. <laughs> I be saying shit like that. <laughs> I really do be saying that. <laughs> you don't say shit like that. <laughs> you ever call him daddy or some shit like that? <laughs> Nah, I like, you gotta do that serious. I like that shit. I like that shit. <laughs> Calling me daddy is my love language, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I bet he, he probably fuck with it. Alright, all right, that's alright. I feel, I feel like I don't want to get too in-depth with it, you know? I don't want to make anybody feel uncomfortable. I feel like I've already have, though. <laughs>